Hey y'all, so I am back with another quick review for you guys. This time I'm reviewing two things. I'm reviewing the other two dossier scents that I did not show you all. And then I'm reviewing this hair that I have on that was sent to me. So we're gonna just jump in with the dossier. For you all that have not seen my previous videos, it's a little sloppy, don't mind. Anyway, this is the box it comes in. Okay, this is the inside of the box. And this is the card that they give you with your scent. Okay, so on the card, it lets you know a couple of points. This one is uh, Oriental Vetiver. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but Oriental Vetiver. Um, and then it gives you your notes. So for an example, top notes, bergamot, lemon, buchu, middle notes, orange blossom, marigold, and violet. Base notes, vetiver, amber, and cedarwood. Okay, it lets you know what fragrance it's inspired by. This one is inspired by Byrito, Bal d'Afrique à du Perfume. This, this is too much. <laughs> anyway, the concentration is 18% on this one. They give you a thank you note and how it works. Okay, so that's very thoughtful of them. So let's see what this one smells like, okay? Because if you saw any of my previous reviews, so far I have like two favorites. But anyway, okay, right at first, it's giving me like a manly cologne. Um, Would I wanna smell my man in this? Let me see. Let me see, make sure this don't get on me. It's, I don't know if I want to smell my man in this, but maybe like uncle or granddad or somebody. Uh, it's a little, for my liking, it's a little old man-ish, okay? So I'm just moving right along to the second fragrance. Again, this is how the box looks. This one is floral pear, and I like things that are mainly like floral. The top notes on this is pear, bergamot, watermelon, rhubarb, middle notes, quince, rose, freesia, orange blossom, and base notes, woody notes, musk, and amber. Okay, I already told y'all I don't really like musky uh, scents, but we gonna see since it has all the other things. This one is inspired by Joe Malone, English pear, and freesia cologne, and the concentration on this one is also 18%. Um, this one does come with like a little sample thing. So I guess that you could try this first before actually using the scent. Now, all of them, all of the ones that they sent me did not include this. And maybe that's just because I'm reviewing it. I don't know. But I think with your purchase, you will receive the small one first. So that if you do not like it, you don't even have to open it. Um, you could just send it back. Well, I'm going to just go ahead and spray it because I'm not sending it back. Let's see. Let's, let's, that other one, I don't know. Okay, this one is decent. This one, this one is, this one is okay. Let me see. It's kind of still that other scent lingering around. This one is doable, but once again, these are giving me like, people who like more um, woodsy scents, you know? If you like them more, if you like the woodsy type of uh, scents, you know, you're not a real sweet, florally or linen clean person, you want something like a little more spicy, then you will like these two scents. Um, I don't know what the original scent smell like to really see if they hit it, you know, head on, but I will tell you based on the other since that I have reviewed, uh, compared to the ones that I know that I do know how the original smells, they did a really good job. So with that being said, if you wanna purchase any of the scents that I've previously reviewed, you can use my discount code below. I think that you can combine my discount code with whatever promotion that they have going on. I'm not sure, but just give it a try because I think you can, which is great. That means you're getting the fragrance for little to nothing, okay? So now, we're gonna move on to this hair. 
Okay, so some company on Amazon reached out to me. They said they wanted to send me some hair um, for a review. I, on Amazon, it says brand name is Anamu. I'll um, list the description in the bottom. It's a highlight lace front wig, human hair, pre-plucked straight ombre, honey blonde, brown. It's a, a mix of T4 slash 27. And then the density on it is 180, it's saying. Um, and it's 12A Brazilian version hair. So I'm confused. They got a they got a lot on here. Anyway, and it's supposed to be 22 inches, okay? Because at the top it says human hair, which I mean Brazilian is still human, but it's supposed to be anyway. I'm not sure about the accuracy of this description, you all, but I will just get into the specs of the hair. Um, so I did not uh, film it with it just straight out the box, but I do have a picture of myself with it straight out the box. I think I still have it, if so I include it at the end. Um, but what I did, I just tried to put like a little concealer and things on my lace and I tried to cut out like, you know, just some baby hair for my parameter and um, I just, I took like my wand curlers and I just bump just a few curls throughout it just to see like how it would do with the heat or whatever so it's pretty good the one thing i will say about the hair it says 22 inches but really it feels more like 18 maybe 20 like it doesn't give me 22 inches um and i i wouldn't even really say the density is 180 either but I would say the density is probably like 120 but um that's how they describe the wig okay uh it is the 22 inch is 144.50. One thing I will say, they delivered it quickly, and they also included a couple of things that I'll show you. So when the wig came, it came in this baggie, and of course it was in the plastic. And then you can see some purple wrapping because they had the purple wrapping around it. It came with a um, a, a, a comb. And it came with a stocking cap, which I didn't put on. And then they just gave you a couple of other trinkets. Oh, it had a net over it also. Um, and then they just included like a little hair clip and two ponytail holders uh, with pearls on them in a bow, if you can see that. So that's cute, that was nice. They included a few things. Now I will say I did notice like moderate shedding um, which I believe it, it was like a normal amount of shedding. So this is only like my second day really like having this hair on. So I could tell you that it is really soft. It's really pretty. And I think that it's like manageable. It's like easy. You don't have to like do too much. So, so far it seems like easy maintenance. Um, that's what I like about it. I love the color. I got lots of compliments. I did play, uh, put a picture of my stories on Instagram a couple of days ago. And I got a lot of hits on it. I put it in my stories on Facebook and um, Snapchat also. I got a lot of hits on this hair. Um, especially people loving the color. So I just thought I would come do a review because I've never had an Amazon wig before. Uh, would I order from this store? Yes, I would. But the thing that I have an issue with is I don't think the accuracy is there as far as the inches. So I would go up two inches. Um, I think 22 inches is the longest that they offer with this hair. But I'm just saying like if you want 20, just go ahead and spend an extra few dollars and get the 22 inches, okay? So other than that, so far so good. And I might take my time to really play with this some more as far as because I don't know how to lay wigs like that okay I made it do what it do for this video you guys so hopefully you enjoyed this give me a thumbs up if you did feel free to leave a comment if you have any questions I will have all the details for the dossier colognes uh, and the hair listed below and any discount codes and I will see you guys on the next video mm -hmm.